Maple Leafs hosting the Kings, and the Kings are plus 128 on the money line. The Leafs are minus 154. The over-under, six and a half goals. The Kings, getting a goal and a half on the puck line, are minus 182, meaning if you bet them that way, they win this game outright. You win, they lose by one goal, you win. And the Leafs, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, are plus 150, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two goals or more. Wall has been confirmed in net for the Leafs, and it's supposed to be Talbot, but he's yet to be confirmed for the Kings tomorrow. Thank you for everyone who has joined my Discord and who continues to join my Discord. Today was a rough day for me, and I'm not even going to pretend to lie about that one. Um, but we will bounce back tomorrow. Now, head-to-head, -head, the home team's on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 7-3. and three. The Leafs are 6-4 and four in their last 10 against the Kings. The favorite is 7-3 and three on the money line. The favorite laying a goal and a half on the puck line is 6-4. and four. There have been two one-goal games in their last 10 meetings, none in the last four that they've played against each other. The under is hitting their last two, the under is six and four, and the under six and a half goals is eight and two. They played each other twice last year. The Kings won four to two in LA, the Leafs won five nothing in Toronto. In their last handful of games overall, the last five games that the Kings have played have gone over, and they are three and two in those games. For the Leafs, the last three games that they've actually played have gone under, shockingly enough, and they've won three out of the four of those games. I'm going to take the Leafs with the money line. I'm going to take the Leafs laying the goals, and I'll go over in this one. I imagine that they're probably going to have to outscore the Kings, especially if they're putting a backup in net. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.